Welcome to this instalment of Talking Trim. I'm Jonathan Skinner and today we are looking at the Jaguar S-Type and 420 front and rear door panel kit. So we sell this as a kit of four for the front and rear door panels. Included in that are also materials to re-trim your current front door torpedo armrests and the rear door uh, pocket armrests as you can see. However, in this video here, we've actually fully trimmed both sets of armrests, which is an optional extra. Worth bearing in mind that the door panel kit, including the loose materials for retrimming those armrests, is included as part of our trim kit, uh, with the trimmed versions uh, also an optional extra. That being said, let's dive in. So this has been done in new tan vinyl, or tan, as most people refer to it. We can also offer in leather if you prefer. It includes the HF embossed pattern, which we have the welding machine in-house. We're one of the only companies in the world that can offer the original tooling for this, as you can see there. So it's literally embossed into the vinyl and this can be done on leather as well. We also do the embossed pattern on the very top edge there, which was original for the cars. But it's worth noting that not many other companies in the world have, let alone that pattern, but they almost certainly a mix that one there. We're one of the only companies, if not the only company, that bother putting in this HF world at the top, as well as the rubber on the back there. It's just the extra lumps that we go to. On the front doors, it does have the elasticated pocket flap for storing maps or iPhones, I guess. Um, in there, that, that's uh, included as standard. You can see, obviously, we've got the torpedo armrest there, just loosely placed over the top in the basic position that it goes. So materials are included as part of the set to retrim your current ones, or for, for an optional cost, we can do them for you. As you can see here, very nice, neat finish on them there. The backs of the panels, so everything's cut on our in-house CNC machine out of uh, tempered hardboard, uh, 2.55 mil, specially imported. Has all of the pilot holes that you need for the various fixings around the door including obviously the torpedo armrest there. Then you've got the window winders and the door release uh, there. Uh, you've got the main fixings around the outside. You'll notice we do a, an overlap on the front edge of the door panel there. That is intentional, big overlap. The fixing holes are underneath there. You have to run your finger along to find them. Uh, the reason for that overlap is when you actually open the door, uh, there is an overlap uh, on the actual metalwork of the door and you can look down and you can see part of the panel. So we do that intentionally. Uh, so that it covers that and it ties in with the trim. Moving on to the rear doors, very similar concept. You still have the embossed pattern with again, the one at the top and the rubber that you can see there. Uh, back of the panel, same again. You have all of the necessary pilot holes for the fixings, etc. including you can see here, all of the ones for this armrest pockets here. So armrest pockets, normally a sewn retrim kit with some other loose bits for you to retrim your originals or for an optional extra cost we can supply you with brand new molded ones and fully trim it up for you they're a bit of a beast to trim these saying very lightly that um so just bear that in mind not for the faint of heart even for a professional trimmer uh but we can offer help and advice and photos on the trimming process of that so yeah i think that covers the bases so as stated a couple of times Door panels, the four of them are sold as a set, including materials to retrim the armrest, both front and rear. Same again, that is all included as part of our trim kit. Optional extras for both would be trimmed up versions of the armrest, both front and rear. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, check out our website for more details. Uh, please remember to subscribe, like, and share with other classic car enthusiasts. Till next time, cheers.